Cool. Quentin, thanks for coming down. You Paul bet. here, Music Villa, Bozeman, Montana, and we are checking out this new 018 uh, 12 fret. This little guy is super cool. Um, you know, mahogany back and sides. It's an 018 12 fretter, joins the body at the 12th fret, spruce top. This one's a one and eleven or one and three quarter uh, nut width and just a great little guitar. Slotted headstock. Yep. Uh, it's a classic. Know, it is a classic. You know, it's just a little small body X brace scalloped guitar and um, it is just cool. Yeah, you know, and when when you play it, you pick it up and you're like, oh, it feels light, mm -hmm. you know. And so again, as I've said in some other videos. When I pick up and I feel like guitar, to my mind, it's signaling that this thing's going to resonate yeah. well because it's not, it's not pushing a lot of glue or heavy thick wood. It's yep. it just, it's it's uh, you know, it's going to amplify well. Yeah. And I think you, this guitar does exactly that. It demonstrates the proof of the principle. It's very projective. Um, based on the body style, the EQ that I'm hearing in the room, again, not always sure how well it translates, but in the room, it's it's. It's got present low end, but it, it's well balanced. But it's it's loud. But it's got it's. Loud. And it's just fun, and it's compact. Yeah. You know, it's um, playability is 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 good. Yeah. You know, um, and and because of the twelve fret, it feels like you're yeah. just you're. You know, you're in tight. And people are going to, you know, what I mean, these are just really popular right now in every way. I mean, everyone seems to kind of need a small body guitar. You have to have a big body, you know, and, and with this kind of guitar, there's just, there's so many applications for it. You know, I think of this, I think of these guitars, especially the 12 fretters. This is a really dumb analogy, but I'm going to throw it out there. I think of these guitars uh, mm -hmm. as playing the way Mike Tyson used to fight, right? He's tight, that's, not a giant long guy, but... He's compact and he's powerful. Yeah. And that's what this guitar is. It's compact and powerful. <laughs> and it really, it just, it he just was, pops you. He was big. He, I mean, he wasn't, he was, like, he wasn't yeah. a stand back jab guy. He was yeah. like, get up he in there like, and, yep. you know, yeah. kind of uppercut you. But, and of. that's what this guitar just gets you right on the chin. Yeah. Terrible analogy. I apologize in advance. But man, but, remember those years? Oh, those years of Mike Tyson. Oh, punch out? That you was know? crazy. That's that's yeah. where I learned all about boxing. Then he tattooed his face, yeah, which is great because you then know it, it would went. we have would the hangover be as good as it was without the face? <laughs> <laughs> Who knew? What a genius to think that far ahead that exactly be a, a, a plot. Uh, all right. Component. Well, I love it. Finger picking. Maybe a little finger picking on this one. Magic Wait. word. The magic word. Please. Thank I'm you. Sorry. Okay. I'm not. I, and I'm gonna <laughs> try not to point at it. Thanks, Quentin. You bet. All right. Thanks, everybody. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.